Hey everyone, I'm uh, David from England. I volunteered to do a two-week program to help street kids in uh, New Delhi. Um, the website that I went on to book this uh, volunteer solutions is uh, very straightforward, very easy to use, um, and um, it was very helpful because uh, I had an issue with my visa at the start. Uh, but I emailed them, they got back in touch with me straight away, they helped me through the visa process. Um, it took a matter of days to get sorted and then as soon as I got my visa, I could relax. Um, and you know, they kept checking up to make sure it was okay, telling me, you know, five days to go, three days to go, give me little hints and the information pack up that they give you, it's got all the information you need to where you come to India and it's really fine. Um, obviously, make your way to, to your airport, wherever you fly from, um, and I landed here. As soon as I landed, there's, uh, there was plenty of people meeting me with a bunch of solution signs, it was easy to notice. They took me to the car um, and they took me to the accommodation I was going to stay at. The accommodation is a really nice aircon for sleeping in to keep it comfortable. Um, get, you get cooked breakfast and tea every night. It's all like uh, proper Indian, Indian cuisine. It's really nice stuff that you wouldn't be able to get if you're on the western side of the world. Um, it's hot. So whatever you've packed, pack half as much as you've got because you don't really need um, much clothing. Just a few t-shirts, shorts, you really don't need much. You just keep recycling it here while washing. Um, the experience that I've had here is like, it's been really, really fantastic. Once getting used to the weather and um, the type of food, once you get used to that, it takes a few days. Um, but my program um, was really, really, Really exciting to start, uh, really unique work with street kids, uh, realising what they don't have to what we have um, is a, such a culture shock. Um, and the fact that you're teaching them English and maths and playing and they're always smiling and they're always happy it makes you feel like really, you, you know, really special, especially if you don't come from like an educated background yourself. Um, like if you're not a teacher and you've came and you've managed to actually teach a bit of English, a bit of maths makes you feel like you've actually achieved more in yourself, never mind what they've learnt. Um, and obviously, on the weekends, you, you can organise a few days trip, see the Taj Mahal, which is obviously a unique part of like ag uh, agriculture in itself, which you'll never get to see anywhere else in the world. So, I mean, that makes the tour better than probably all the rest. Um, but altogether, my experience here has been fantastic. Um, I've uh, loved every minute of it, meeting uh, uh, other volunteers that I live with from all over the world, meeting different cultures, learning from different people, um, learning uh, India and uh, learning how they live. And hopefully when I'm back in England, I'll uh, be able to take some of it back home with me. So I'm hoping other people volunteer and uh, come to India and give it a go themselves and see what it's like for themselves.